Hello everyone, it's Aditya here and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to solve a problem beautiful string and the problem statement is that you are given a binary string. By binary string I mean that key there would be only 0 and 1 in that string. So binary string is this 0 1 0. This is binary string because it has only 0 and 1. Now uh, the problem statement says that key you have to make that string beautiful and uh, by beautiful string I mean that key let us say you have this string 0 0 1 so let us say 0 0 1 the alternating characters let us say the character at character of, uh, at 0 at position is 0 and character at first position is uh, 0 so these two are same so this is not beautiful so uh, let us say I flip the character at uh, first position and the second position 0 1 2 second position now this is string is beautiful we have to make that and uh, to solve that let us take an example and uh, we would be going to uh, proceed with that so let us say i have this example uh, 1 0 0 1 now i have to make this a string beautiful so let us say this is the string we have so uh, for this making this beautiful uh, we since we know it is a binary string it can have only these two possibility the first possibility is can it can be having like 0 1 0 1 and possibility 2 of this to, would be 1 0 1 0 like that so uh, what we have to do is key we have to check key how much flips we need to do that to make this input string to the possibility 1 string and how much flip we need to do that to make this uh, s1 string to possibility 2 string so we have to do that and uh, after that we will check key what was let us say we got uh, some x flips in this and some y flips in this so we would be returning key the minimum required like so minimum of these would be our answer so let us take an example of this and uh, with this this only we will proceed it so let us say key 1 0 0 1 and how you know so in uh, first uh, possibility we have 0 1 0 1 let me mark the index of it so that it would be clear to you so this is the 0th index and this is the first index, this is the second index and this is the third index. So uh, you will check the uh, character at 0th index. So 0th index what do you have is 1. Ideally for possibility 1 uh, the 0th index should be 0. So you need to flip this string. Okay. So we will be storing this into some counter. Let us say C1 variable. Now I have to flip one character to make this string into this string now again i will go to the second uh, second character for what should be the ideal what should be the ideal character at second position one and what do we have is zero we would increment the counter okay now uh, we would go to the third position third position as you can see uh, or in the uh, zero base zero base indexing indexing it is two okay so you have two here and uh, you can see these two are matching so we do we won't be incrementing our counter and for the third position as you can see these are also matching so we won't be incrementing so in this case i got two operations okay so first string i have to flip to zero and second string i have to flip to one now this one will become beautiful okay for as compared to like this only this will become to case one now let us say if i want to convert this to this beautiful string we have two possibility right we discussed we can convert either either starting with zero or either starting with one in both of the cases we can see uh, that it is alternating characters in the string are zero one zero one so that makes it beautiful okay so now let us see key if i want to convert this character to this okay what it would be i would writing here one zero zero one now i will check the position position at 0, 0th index it is 1 uh, the character at sorry the character at 0th index is 1 and what should be the ideal character at index uh, 0 is 1 so we won't be incrementing let us say for this second case i have i maintain a counter 2 and i will keep it as 0 okay see because uh, one is uh, one is present at 0 and one is ideal for it position okay now for second uh, for first index i can see zero is already there we won't be we won't be incrementing our counter okay and in third case what i can see is see we have zero here but 
uh, we we cannot have zero because it at this place according to this case it was it should have only one so now we will be incrementing our counter to one and now at the last index as you can see it's zero it should be zero but it is one so we'll increment our counter to two so as you can see either in two ways uh, whether you are converting this to this or to this you are getting the same number of, of flips to be happening so that way the answer to should be here is two now let, let us take another example uh, maybe probably this one zero one zero like that so now in that case um, let us say so we can we have two options for this also we can convert it to like this one zero one zero one okay three two and five okay now we can convert to this this or starting with zero we have two possibilities zero one zero one and one zero so now let us say for this I uh, conversion of this to this I am maintaining C1 counter for conversion of this to this I am maintaining C2 counter. Let us check, uh, take the position of characters over it. I will mark the indexes 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4, 0, 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now check according to this, uh, according to this condition what should be the ideal position. For here it is zero uh, at zeroth index what is one according to this uh, string what it should be it is already one so we won't be incrementing our counter now counter is zero now check the second position it is zero uh, and according to this it is also zero we won't be incrementing now at uh, second index what we can see it is zero here and it should be one because we are converting this so now i will increment my counter according to this now again i third position i'll go okay one is here but here it is zero so again i will increment my counter again i will go to the last string it is zero but according to this string it should be one so again i will increment my counter so to convert this string to this string i have to take three steps or three flips you can say now take an example for this c2 first position is uh, uh, first character is one and we have zero we have to flip it anyway so we'll increment our counter okay now in second position it is zero and it is one again we have to increment the counter and in third position it is zero here it is also zero so we don't increment the counter and in fourth position <clears throat> we have uh, one and here it also it is one we don't increment the counter in fifth position we have zero and zero here so we don't increment the counter so likewise here you can see three and two so which is minimum two in that case two would be answer okay so the algo should be you have to uh, go to the character yeah you have possibly two cases c1 and c2 you have to keep track of this key uh, what is the correct position according to the answer of this there are two cases and uh, what is the correct position of the characters according to this so if it is a zero zero is the starting so at uh, even positions zero should be there and in this at even position one should be there so if that is not the case you just increment the counters of both and in final you can uh, return the minimum of that so okay so thanks for watching i will uh, see you in the next video